welcome to Meaningful Access Interpretation and Translations Tutorial under Language Acquisition Department. My name is Luis Orantes and I'm currently coordinating this program that offers interpretation and translations to our LEPs or Limited English Proficiency Persons. You will click Meaningful Access. As soon as you click this link, you will decide the type of the service that you need, either interpretations or translation services. We'll start this tutorial clicking how to request an interpreter. As soon as, soon as you access interpretation services, a new page will appear. It is important to read and understand or review the interpretation guidelines. Once you click this link and read the guidelines, Go back by clicking Interpretation Services at the bottom of the page. After this step, click Interpretation Request Form Calendar. You will access to a calendar where you will add a request at a specific date that you will need an interpreter. After clicking Add, a new form will pop up on the screen as new item. You will start completing your request using a drop-down menu, typing the nature of the event. In this case, we will type an IEP. Next, you will use the second drop-down field under School or Department. We will use Naylor K-8 through in this case. Next, Click the Language Preference drop-down. We, we will click Arabic. After this, click Event Type. For our tutorial, we will click IEP. Next, click Contact Person for Event. You can click either to logo or the address. Type the person's last name and first name. This is the person who will be the lead of this event. Click Start and Time drop down. You must type the student's name and student's ID number. Now, click yes or no if parent notification has been sent. If you click yes, click save at the bottom of the page. If you choose no, please provide the parent information in order to confirm date and time for your meeting. In this case, in this case you must type parent's name and any available phone numbers for the family. Once this has been done, click Save at the bottom of the page. Now you will notice your request has been created. However, you need to set up an alert in order for us to identify your request and communicate with you. Click your request again and your request will appear on the screen. Look for the icon Alert Me at the top of the request. Once you will add a new alert, choose Send Alerts for these changes. Choose the third option, Someone else changes an event created by me. After this, click OK to finalize your request. We will receive an alert from your school and we will proceed to confirm a meeting, assign an interpreter, and let you know who might take over your request through our, your own request. So far, this is the end in order to request interpretation services.